There's moments where the universe really does swing you a certain way. It's gonna be $237. Take it easy. Bye, thanks. When I look back on my career now, I'm like, I was just not ready for what happened to me. Can you talk a little bit about your experience as like a female artist in the music industry? I'm not gonna sweeten it for anyone. It really sucks. When you're in my head, well, and the winner you is Kate Nash. Everybody wanted to see Kate. There were queues around the block. Our album Made of Bricks, number one on the British charts. Please welcome Kate Nash, everybody. People were like chasing me to a taxi and I was like, I'm not Beyonce. <laughs> the men that I worked with didn't look after me like this 20-year-old girl. They worked me like a donkey and I made loads of money for them. Sold over a million records. It wasn't like I was trying to be a pop star. I just wanted to make songs. I decided, I don't care what you think. I want to make punk rock music, I'm gonna. I was dropped from my record label. As soon as I made something creatively different, they just ditched me. All of a sudden, everything just blew up. I was like, this is the best work I've ever done. I felt like I was being underestimated by my label. As a woman, you can't even scream on an album. But as a man, you can talk about raping bitches, and it's fine. It was really shocking. I was not expecting it at all. I don't know how to move forward without becoming hardened and really changing who I am. I appreciate all of you so much. You're literally the reason that I'm able to continue to do music. I've got enough left in me to go, OK, well, f I'm going to make my own songs. Like, remember why you started doing it in the first place. My freedom of speech is like, Priceless. If you're a girl and you're interested in music, then please don't shy away from it because you feel like you're not good enough. Just do it. I want to eradicate the misconception that female is a genre because it isn't. 